Hey traders, TG Watkins here. It is March 15th when I'm recording this. And for now, we're seeing a little bit of divergence in some of the, the markets and some of the sectors. So we're actually seeing some strength for now in, in tech. Uh, Microsoft is up. Google's kind of holding in there. Uh, the NASDAQ, you know, that kind of stuff. Um, so I think what's happening is there seems to be kind of a, a push-pull, a kind of tug of war between uh, interest rates going down. You know, the TNX is going down. Um, and, you know, it's probably going down for the wrong reasons. There's fear, there's panic, uh, the, the collapse of the economy, the recession, and that kind of stuff. But, you know, tech loves lower rates. And so for right now, it seems as though those lower rates are starting to, are, are having more of a bullish effect than the recession or the economy is having a negative effect. So as I said, we're seeing that with Microsoft, Amazon to a certain extent, you know, Google to a certain extent, they're, they're kind of hanging in there. Now, I, I'm saying for now, because we don't know how long this is going to last, and you know, if the market really does go down, uh, a lot of these things could succumb to these downward forces. Uh, the other thing that is starting to show that there could be some downward forces are is the oil sector. So we've been watching the oil sector uh, essentially top for a long time, and only in through here are we starting to watch it move down. So this is XOP, uh, you could look at OIH, you know, uh, this took a while to finally succumb and now, now pretty big down. So looks to me like there are some, some big things happening out there as far as the energy sector. And um, what, XOM, Exxon Mobil, you know, looks like this thing might have been starting to top out here. You could see that uh, we've got Moxie indicator down here and starting to roll over. Um, so a lot of times people talk about and look at oil as uh, a bellwether for the economy as a whole. And the fact that now oil, and you can even see this USO, is starting to decline, right? And, you know, we've seen it down for quite some time, but now it's really actually breaking down. And uh, this could be the, kind of the last shoe to drop as far as strength of the economy, because when oil goes down, it, uh, it does tend to precede a recession, a lower demand, a lower consumption, that kind of stuff. So yeah, we, I guess the question is, how long can tech stay up because of uh, lower interest rates in the face of a weakening economy? All right, everyone. Thanks again. We'll see you at the next one. Hey, TG here with Simpler Trading. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like or comment below. Also, make sure to subscribe and click that notification bell so you can stay up to date with my market analysis. Or you can join my free newsletter with the link in the description. Good trading, and I'll see you at the next video.